when you're communicating benefits, it's very important that uh, the benefits that are communicated are not just of the intervention that you are describing, but in context of the alternative interventions for the same condition or situation so that uh, whoever is listening can see how much better or how much uh, different is the benefits from what's being communicated. Um, the use of quantitative information is important, but I do recognize that you want to give a, a human face to those numbers. Well, it's very important as you zoom into the human face, so you go from relative uh, uh, importance or relative risk to absolute uh, uh, numbers to then one person perhaps that, that shows, that demonstrates a situation. But it's important to zoom back up again and put back into context of the, uh, you know, how many people that get exposed to this sort of uh, intervention will benefit and compare to what are the alternatives. And then, of course, if you just discuss of the benefits, people might uh, lose the fact that there are potential downsides. And when you discuss the downsides, don't just uh, stay with the downsides as reported by the studies, but think about the downsides that were not measured, uh, but matter in people's lives. So how inconvenient is this? How expensive will this be? To what extent will it interrupt my life or limit my ability to do things? And how do those compare to the, alter to the alternatives available?